In this video, we're gonna go over a simple back in stock notifier on your WooCommerce site that is free and easy to set up. So right here, I have this out of stock product and I wanna add a you know, back in stock form or subscribe to get notified when the product's back in stock. So how do I do this? How do I add this form? How do I still get people going to this page and signing up or subscribing when the product's back in stock? Well, let's go over it, but first, if you're new here, make sure to hit that like and hit that subscribe and all the links can be found in the description box below. Okay, let's jump into it. So I'm gonna go to my plugins and I'm going to add this back in stock and this is a free plugin and I'm gonna install it and then I'm gonna activate the plugin. So when after activating the plugin, if I refresh this on an out of stock product, I see that there is a subscribe form. So let's say I add in just a random email and click subscribe now. So it lets me know I have successfully subscribed and it will let me know when it's back in stock. So you can customize all these, this text and so forth in the plugin settings, but your customer will receive you know, a notification that they have subscribed to this product and they will get notified when it's back in stock. So now if I go back here and the product gets set to, you know, back in stock, right? And I do that and then I view this product again, the back in stock notifier is no longer there and your customers will also receive an email that the product is back in stock. So again, you can customize, you know, the text on these emails in the plugin settings and let's say I put this product back out of stock. So if I put it back out of stock, I'm seeing this um, back in stock notifier form and I can continue to customize this how I would like to by going to the settings right here and choosing my customization options. So let's say I want to do a pop-up, I could, and I also could, you know, show the name or hide the first name, you know, show the phone number field, you know, specific settings for guests and so forth. So I'm just gonna come down here and click save changes. And I also want to add some custom CSS to make that subscribe form right here more on brand with the colors of my site. So I can put this snippet in the description box below, but I'm just gonna add some additional CSS and I'm gonna copy this and paste this. And after clicking publish and I refresh right here, I can see that this is now on brand for my site and everything looks pretty nifty. And I also could take this a step further if I wanted this form to be you know like a max width of let's say 400 pixels i could do something like that as well so i could just you know use this css if i wanted to add some further customizations like that and now that's what i see so i'm just going to remove this i'll put this all in the description box below but as you can see, this is just a simple, easy um, back in stock notifier plugin that is free, can be used on simple products, variation products, simple subscriptions, variable subscriptions, etc. So don't make the mistake of editing your product when it's out of stock and setting it to a draft mode because then people or private, I, I see that from time to time, people setting it to private or draft. Always keep it published and use a back in stock notifier. And now you don't have an excuse because here's a nice nifty little plugin that is free and that you can use to power up your store. And you also will be able to see the subscribers right here. So you'll be able to see them and you'll see what date they subscribed on. And you'll also be able to see what product they subscribed on. So this is nice and little handy. You can export these to a CSV. I think it's a $5 add on to use their you know, it's a free plugin, but if you want to use like their add-on to export these people to a CSV, that is something they offer. So overall, 
hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and you got value out of it. If you did, make sure you give me a like, give me a thumbs up, and all links can be found in the description box below. Have a great rest of your day. Peace.